god, this side's actually really good. This is so weird. <laughs> School dinner cake. It was the height this of is the awful. Don't really <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm starting this weekly vlog on a Thursday But I just woke up and felt like doing a weekly vlog. I'm just about to go work out. I'm gonna go in my garden although Looking a bit chilly. I started Chloe things. I think it's the hourglass ab and butt one and on day two I did day one last week and I haven't worked out since but we won't talk about that. Look my freckles started to come out on the weekend Finally, yay. I was just trying to shoot this hairstyle for my Instagram and I just couldn't get the angle on my camera and my tripod. Like, it was frustrating me so much that so I called my brother in and he got it in like four minutes. Like, honestly, I just need, I miss you, Jed. Like, I need a personal photographer. It makes so, life so much easier. For those of you who don't know, I actually did start a new job during lockdown, which has been weird to say the least. Um, like, everything being virtual and stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna go get some lunch. This is like my favourite at the moment. It's just bagel, toast a little bit, fried egg with some cheese and oh my god i just love it this one bagel actually doesn't have like a big hole in the middle as you can see so like the egg's not going to squeeze through it and then i also just have some snacker jacks they're also my favorite i have my meeting now it is 2 30. Okay, so that one is done. Um, I've now got like another company call in 10 minutes. Time is half five. My mum's cooking soup downstairs with some homemade bread. So I'm really excited for that. It's carrot and something. I don't actually know what it is. Happy Friday. Friday, Friday. Gotta get down on Friday. Just off to do day three of Chloe Ting's abs and butt hourglass one. So... There's three different videos today. I didn't. I just realised that like it's pretty much the same videos, kind of. The only thing is with some of these, like this music, I, f I f hate it so much. Like Heather Robertson has better music, but I mean you can always play your own music over. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. Bacon with sorrel. So we're making school tray cake. That's a lot of sugar as well. This is the recipe old school retro sprinkle tray bake from Ula Living. There's actually a shop in Dawson. Oh, probably, I don't know if it's open now, but they sell like all the old school cakes, like the mama jam on. Oh, I love the mama jam on and the uh, coconut yeah. sprinkles. That was my favourite. Chocolate cake and chocolate oh, it's raining. How can it go from being so sunny? I like this. You want to put butter at the bottom and then you put your bacon stuff on here. Your bacon stuff. Is it nice? Did you try it? Mm. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. You see her walking down the boulevard. She got the posture of a superstar. She looks so fly in those Gucci slides. Yeah, yeah, I wonder where she hides under her disguise. Yeah, 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 yeah. And all the girls around the world, they want to be. Good in the cake. I stretched this morning and, like, I don't know, like, I feel like I did. Well, yeah, that's when I think I did something to my neck and, like, it hurts. Like, kind of look up like that. Get off to be an M. that bad in there. We didn't have like any curry sauces like, at all. We had um, gel freezing. All pasta sauces. Really. Yeah, all pasta sauces. And had rice. Mm, and pasta. And one, yeah, and pasta. But it still wasn't that soft though. It literally was sunny when we left. <laughs> little while well, next quarter past nine. Oh my god, I swear to god, the evenings just absolutely fly by. I've got to show you the cake. We had it with pink custard, so it was so good. I'll just that little picture of her now, honestly. You guys need to make it like it literally was just amazing it tasted exactly like like the ones that you get in school i thought i would show you what i do with my hair I don't really <laughs>
I wash my hair once a week and I blow dry. I only blow dry the roots. And I spray a little bit of heat protectant on my roots. Okay, next, all I like to do is this is a Garnier Ultimate Blends. This is the papaya one. These are like a three in one mask, so you can either use it as a conditioner, use it as an actual mask on wet hair and then wash it out, or you can do what I'm going to do with it and just get a little bit and just run it through this of your hair. It reduces the appearance of spit ends and obviously leaves your hair smelling really good and really soft. I just leave my hair, the rest of my hair to dry naturally but what I am going to be doing today is actually trying out. Have you seen it on TikTok though? They get like, get the um, belt of a dressing gown and they like do that curly thing with it. I'm also going to fake tan because I just, I don't know why but these past couple weeks in lockdown, I'm, I don't know, I just love fake tanning like it just makes me feel so much better. I'm all a fake tan now, although I don't think you can really tell. Last night I started watching it Never However on Netflix and I recommend. I'm halfway through episode four at the moment. I can explain it. If you like, like, to all the boys I've... This is really rude. Why do I keep going so dark? There we go. If you like, um, to all the boys I've loved before, that kind of thing. Does it annoy anybody else when you get in bed, but... I've left my wardrobe door open and that is we just we i can't have that the kissing booth like just that kind of like cringy really cringy teenage cringy kind of thing then i i think you'll love this the episode's only like half an hour long so literally it's binge worthy morning guys it's the weekend and i'm gonna take these out um to be honest i don't know how well this is gonna work because i'm really impatient and i should have really let my hair dry a bit more before i did it look at those ends this bit of my hair was actually dry and look at that you can tell like that is still damp i'll do it again tonight <laughs> hopefully it turns out a bit better than this because yeah my hair is literally still damp i've just done this with my hair for now but i'll have to sort it out later because look at it and i need to film but right now me and my mum are gonna go through all her just come in all her old clothes i've done this before but i think a couple years ago obviously my style has changed Quite a bit. Hey Jazz, hey boy. Can I get past please? Can I get past please? Excuse me bouncer. So we've got the first bag out of the attic. These are tops from the 80s or 70s I think my mum just said. Um, I can see it up a vintage next label there. This is the pile of stuff i found so far. This is a little tie top that i found but obviously I don't have the right bra on for it now. <laughs> what did you say this is? It was like when Cars was out. What's his name? You know, David Bay. All the electronic music. It was. Um, I yeah. Where it used to go dancing in it, nightclubbing. This is awful, Mum. <laughs> this is absolutely. It's not. It was the height this of fashion. This is awful. Okay, so we finished up in there. I think this is actually a belt for some trousers, but I thought around my head as like a little headband, which is the same. I'm gonna do with this one. These were, for, were from some of my mum's trousers as well. So yeah, those look cool, like round my head. These are just like some kind of like flary wide leg jeans from Whistles. Really <laughs> just with down. Dresses, with this weirdest. This is so weird. <laughs> it's literally the weirdest you thing ever. Done up yes, I have. I bought it. <laughs> I never wore it. Well, in a jumble sale or, or off a market in Bath. You could cut the collar off. I say you could restart it. So I haven't vlogged in a while but because my memory card um, was in my computer and I also filmed a video and I got Emily to help me out and then we stayed on FaceTime for a bit. So that was nice. You know when your room is a mess and you want to tidy it but like it's also half nine and you want to chill. I'll try that thing again with my hair tonight even though like it's cold but i'm just gonna spray some water in it and try it because i want to know if it works for future reference i want to see how long they last and if like it actually holds in my hair i'm picking up the camera late in the day today three o'clock um to be honest i haven't really done much today i said i was gonna have like a movie day and stuff and i haven't done that i've just been sat on youtube doing nothing also i didn't do anything with my hair because i actually fell asleep so it's just like I miss um but i'm gonna do it tonight good morning guys it's a new week and as you can tell i didn't do those things again do you know what it was i was actually gonna do it i'm gonna look an absolute mess um yeah look at my hair i was actually gonna do it and then at like 2010 i just started feeling really really tired and i think it was just all the lack of sleep from last week just catching up with me because i slept so long last night so i fell asleep for me anyway i fell asleep at like 10 woke up 
at eight this morning i'm gonna do it again tonight i'm literally doing like the biggest chore ever i'm putting all of my winter clothes away and getting my summer ones out i mean i'm not getting all of them out like i'm gonna leave some dresses away and stuff because like i just don't think i'm gonna get to wear them this year all of my summer pajamas are now out this is full of winter clothes for ebay i've got another bag full of stuff that i want to put on depop found this oh my god <laughs> oh my god um there we go oh my god it looks so funny i've just found my just my it looks so funny i've just found my first justin bieber top i literally remember i think it was like 20 pounds from hmv i literally remember going to like Stratford Old Shopping Centre to HMV and buying this with my friends. I was so, so, so excited. It's so small. It's a size large, a ladies' large, but honestly, like, it's tiny. These and this pair here are my mum's Levi jeans that don't fit me. Okay, so we're, okay, so we're starting to get somewhere. I've just stopped to have a little snack break because this is tiring. But um, yeah, all of my winter clothes are in here. I've got all of my winter coats away apart from three i think for now i'm just going to put one in this suitcase here and so i can figure out what to do with them um this suitcase is full of winter stuff that needs to be sold but it's just going to go stay in there for now because obviously people aren't going to be buying winter stuff this is all stuff that i need to put away um and then i'm going to sort out my wardrobe in that crate there stuff i need to put away and then clothes on top it's such a long process but once it's done it's done and when I did it in January, I felt so much better after I did it. So I just know, like, I'll feel so much better when, once I've done this. And especially now, like, we are spending so much time in our rooms. I need my room tidy and clean. My wardrobe at the moment, I had to put all of, like, my um, mini bags in here. All the ones that I could hang up, I've just put in here for now because, like, I had a bit of space in here. This is my wardrobe before. And this is it after. And... Honestly, there's actually more stuff in here than there was before because I had loads of clothes to put away. But because it's so packed, you can't even see that, like, I've actually organised it. Look, all my stripes and then um, checks together. These are my shirts. Short-sleeved shirts here. Um, look, colour-coded and everything. But you just can't even see because it's just so packed in here. But that's fine down there looks a little bit better there's all my skirts and then i've put like blazers um leather jackets denim jackets that's just a cardigan and then down there i've just got like tracksuit shorts and stuff put through these although i mean it's not very tidy at all i've had my dinner and now i'm just relaxing i'm actually watching Gemma's new series i watched the first one and loved it and this is like diva on lockdown or something like that oh, wait it's starting now i better mute it honestly i just love it i'm just having a really chilled evening i'm already in my pajamas and i've got a monster which to be honest probably isn't the best thing to drink at eight i'm oh god i need to do these nails as well look at them they're so chipped and disgusting so i might actually do those good morning guys um so I don't know if these are going to have worked because, to be honest, I don't think my hair is completely dry. Like, I literally hardly even wet it. Better than last time, but it's still not completely dry. It's not bad, but I think next time I'll literally spray it how I originally did it, like the tiniest bit. Oh my god, this side's actually really good. This side is definitely better than this side, but... Oh my god, I'm impressed. This side's a bit more wavy rather than curly, which is annoying. Okay, so I'm half ready, just getting ready to film. Um, I'm filming a recreating my Pinterest board outfits, kind of like in a lookbook style. I've got all of my outfits. I laid it on my bed here, a little sneak peek for you guys. But yeah, the video is already going to be up, so I'll leave it um, on the screen now up here. Or is it up there? And I'll also leave it in the description box, honestly these outfits and i'm just getting my accessories out that i need also this is a task that needs to be done i'm going to sort through this I need to sort through this drawer like look at all of these old chokers that i don't wear it's like my secret drawer in my dressing table this does need a lick of paint we are going to repaint it all these earrings like 
wow and i'm also gonna sort out up here so here are like my um football oh my god look at the dust on that that's how you can tell that i haven't touched it this needs to go in the bin god knows what is in here that needs to be sorted out like it's just a mess up here so i have just oh god that's bright i've just finished filming um it took a little bit longer than i expected like a lot longer I just put the ordinary lactic acid on because I haven't used it in a while and oh god my button just came undone um I've forgotten how good it is but I am the worst person ever I haven't well this morning I went on a dog walk and I just vlogged a little bit of that but apart from that I haven't picked up my camera half 11 it's literally half 11 I thought it was like half 10 I've started normal people the BBC series I kind of wanted to read the book first because I actually haven't read the book but I've started it now I think I'm on episode three and I'm enjoying it so far what I like is episodes are only like 25 minutes long so you can watch one quickly like before bed like, I'll probably watch one more and then head off to sleep hey guys so I'm just about to go in my garden and do a workout a little bit later for me today I normally work out bit earlier it's not actually that late to be fair to be honest i was getting a little bit bored of the chloe ting what ting ones because it is just like she just mixed it up from a selection of like five videos kind of can't be bothered for today's but i'm just gonna get over and done with because i know i'll feel better when i've done it just in the garden having my breakfast and i have a good old curried egg mayo sandwich i haven't had this in absolute ages because i've been having fried egg bagel but i've really fancy them so i've literally been doing nothing all day i'm not gonna lie i've been kind of bored but you know when you just can't be bothered to do anything that's literally me i just like sat in the garden read for a bit i ordered some shoes from asos and they came today um but they're too small annoyingly they're my size but they're too small they obviously just run really small i'm hoping the size up come size up come back in stock but they are on sale sizes have been coming in and out of stock just because I think, because obviously they do run small, I think a lot of people are sending them back. I'm going to do a face mask and like some skincare later because I feel like I've kind of been neglecting my skin the past week or so, which is why this happened. It must be my lucky day today or something because um, I literally checked the shoes on my blood. Guys, I really apologise by the way I've looked during this vlog, but you know, this is the reality and I want to be like, real with you guys like i do not put makeup on every day like i'm not gonna put makeup on just because i'm vlogging this is what i look like greasy hair hair wash day tomorrow so we're on like sixth day hair at the moment i checked the shoes and still said out of stock and then literally like a couple of seconds later i got a notification through on my phone and it was like go 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 your size is back in stock so i literally was like managed to get them fingers crossed because you know sometimes when like stock is that low it can sometimes get cancelled fingers crossed that does not happen with them and these trousers i've had my eye on on pretty little thing completely sold out because they were in the sale they were sold out when i first found them and i've been checking pretty much every single day and they've gone down to 12 pounds now they were 15 pounds they've gone down to 12 and they had a size 10 so i managed to get those as well just put a face mask on but me and my mum have well i say me and my mum my mum pretty much i cracked like two eggs and added some baking powder just made a coconut and banana well we made one coconut um cake and then well, like a loaf and then we made a banana bread as well the coconut one is so so good i'll find out what recipe she used and i'll link it in the description box because honestly i just couldn't stop eating it last time she made i'm gonna put on normal people yeah, everyone fancies him the main guy but to be honest i don't see it i left my camera upstairs but this is the coconut one look at the banana bread it's rising so much i'm gonna close it because i don't think it's finished good morning guys i fell asleep last night watching normal people but obviously it's now the next day it's half six in the morning um, I'm actually quite tired but we're going out early today on a dog walk. I kind of feel like I'm getting up to go to the airport which is a little bit sad to 
to be honest. I'm gonna finish this vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry if it was a bit boring, because to be honest, I can't even remember what I even vlogged last week. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please do subscribe if you enjoyed this, and also hit that thumbs up button, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.